Hey guys, so what is up? This is Gothcat here to give you our slash title gore, a subreddit dedicated to uh, subreddit post titles that make zero sense. In other words, um, worthy of a sub a subreddit such as uh, r slash I had a stroke. Yeah. Um, so some of these, uh, basically, I'm going to be doing a mix of uh, titles I think I can interpret versus those that that are <laughs> that are pretty much uninterpretable you know i try to make a decent mix um i kind of figured after doing sad buddy return i thought i'd make something a little more ptsd friendly hopefully um so all right without further ado let's get started i am literally that one at age two in my friend group who are all the equivalent of age three yeah obviously <laughs> Yeah, I think I think when I saw this, I'm thinking maybe uh, maybe uh, they mean that oh, I'm the uh, one, I'm the slightly younger one in my friend group. But I mean, to me, that's pretty obvious. Um, unless they, unless uh, there's a Minecraft flair in there, so they could mean that uh, they could mean that they that their Minecraft account is only two years old when their friends is three years old or whatever. But uh, Alright, next title. Everyone 1999 born now is 2009 is 10 now year 10 ago. Yeah, no. Unless they mean that people born before, on or before this month in 1999 is now 20. I mean, it's like, why would they mention 2009? Uh, and yes, I did upvote that one in the sub. Yes, I am subscribed to said sub. Right. Today I learned that Anal Bell the doll that in the same universe as the Couscous Jury 1 and 2 2016-2017 and the Non-Red 2018 was actually faked and looked not creepy in IRL because holy wood faked for money and fame. It just it just looks like uh, it just looks like multiple trains of thoughts sort of blended together. I can't fucking interpret that one. All right, next. Moon is safest place than Earth because in Iroth every people die, but on Moon nobody die. You wanna know why nobody dies on the Moon? It's because nobody lives on the Moon. <laughs> just because nobody died on the Moon doesn't mean it's safer than Earth, which is what I think they're trying to say. Next, PewDiePie IQ, PewDiePie fans IQ, and all of T-Series IQ and T-Series fans IQ. The only thing I get, the only thing I understand is PewDiePie versus Tier Series. <laughs> the IQs, I don't have a fucking clue. Assuming 175 apostrophe 000 thousand of men ejaculates every minute, nearly 475 grams of sperm. Where all this sperm will get stored? Mostly will go to the sink, then what? I think, I think, uh, <clears throat> I think what they're asking is, you know, where does all this sperm, sperm from, uh, fapping go, maybe? Or just spontaneous ejaculation or something. Um, uh, uh, and to answer that, which I'm assume is what they're asking, uh, probably goes anywhere from a sock to a tissue, uh, down down the drain of a bathtub. Uh, not so much sink, I don't think. I don't have a penis or anything, but <laughs> okay. Next up. Ha 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 Ooh, as a a a ya 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 ta ta I am so sorry about that I was an a a a a a a a a a a a small amount a small amount a small amount a small amount With 
It sounds like it looks like something a person would write. Why? <laughs> All right, next. The publicans are the domest and also the poorest, according to the top ten welfare recipients by state. Uh, yeah, obviously it's the little accents and reverse accents that ruin this fucking sentence. So let me try reading it without the accents. Republicans are the dumbest and also the poorest, according to the top 10 welfare recipients by state. Do you have statistics to back that up? I mean, I mean, I'm not exactly right wing. In fact, I'm center left. But if you want to make an argument against an opposing political party, you know, have something to back it up. Uh -huh. What, is, what do they even mean by top... How do you get the top 10 welfare recipients? And what does that even mean? Uh, of course, of course. It's it's title course, so it's not supposed to make sense, but... Yeah, if you want to argue against an opposing uh, political uh, party or faction, you gotta have something else to back that shit up, you know? And I'm all for President Trump being impeached. Fuck him. All right, next up, why sex with slash without condor? Um, uh, to me, it looks like they're just asking why people have sex without a condom. Uh, <laughs> here misspelled condor. Um, one, uh, they do that. No, one they are, uh, okay. So basically, the reason why people have sex without condoms is one. They want to have babies, uh, two, um, they're trying to use alternative, uh, they're trying to get the woman on the pill because it's uncomfortable, or three, they're, they're just fucking irresponsible. All right, next. If you have afro hair and you sit in front of me in the movies, when I tap you on the shoulder and you turn, the last thing you're gonna feel is this huge dick down your throat? I mean, <laughs> I guess I guess if I guess if a person with a tall afro or something um, is sitting in front of maybe a short person, it might get in the way a little bit. At least if the arrangement is, uh, at least if they're like in the uh, flat bottom of the uh, little uh, theater area, you know. But you know, first of all, that can be solved by. I mean, unless you have no choice, you know, you can just uh, sit in a row above them. Plus, uh, plus, uh, natural afros have, or, natural afros are, basically, black people are having to battle to wear their natural hair and work, so. But then we get to this part where, um, the last thing this person feels is a quote-unquote huge dick down your throat? What, are, are you suggesting that... Are you suggesting that you face rape this person? I mean, they don't even have to be black, because... Fun f uh, it, it, is, it doesn't even matter if they're black or not, you know? You don't face rape people for any reason <laughs> whatsoever. I mean, is this a troll? Oh, uh, boy. And then we have this uh, little uh, graphic. Um, I think I took another screenshot. Yeah, it's basically it's basically this uh, little graphic. Um, I guess someone drew a gun or something using random special characters. Well, an arrangement of random special characters. And it's under PewDiePie. Alright. NSFW. What do excite girls most to be said during sex? Um, I guess what they're asking is, you know, what can you say to a girl to excite her the most during sex? I mean, obviously it depends on the person, you know. Girl, guy, whatever, you know. That's something you kind of have to establish ahead of time. You know? <laughs> Right next, emo popel are not 
S exist black hair. It's not Israel in the real world, only in Minecraft and TV shows. What? <laughs> of okay, so first of all, what do emos have to do with quote unquote black hair? And I guess, I guess they use the uh, name of the country Israel in to replace the uh, two words um, is real. Um, but whatever is on only exists in Minecraft and TV shows. I mean, is this per person suggesting that afros don't exist, that natural afros don't exist in real life, or or maybe the uh, or maybe uh, emo hair dyed black? I mean, of course, this is fucking title gore next. Two prehistoric worms, which became alive and began to eat after 32,000 years, and the other is after 41,700 years. <sighs> what what does that have to do with anything? Oh, like, oh, <laughs> plus, how do um, the uh, ages listed here? Are they are they talking about like the ages of fossils? Like what? Penis man, pew pew, ah uh, ha ha ha, po ha, uh, no no, uh, pew, new, ah, uh, ba la la la, penises man to the rescues. <laughs> the only thing I think is that someone was fucking acting out their fantasies involving penises and guns, I don't know. Penis lasers? Okay. White boy triggered by race trading white girl. <laughs> uh, boy. Race trading, you mean. Fuck. Are, are you talking about like forcibly labeling? Are you talking about like forcibly, sort bleh, forcibly putting an ethnic label on somebody? But he's the one triggered or. Did this white girl label him? Ugh, fuck. Today I learned scientists put slime mold over a map of Tokyo with food used to represent urban areas. After a day, the mold created a network nearly identical to Tokyo's rail network, which was designed to be as efficient as possible. The slime mold did the same, but without a brain. Okay, so basically what this person is saying, I guess, I guess scientists do a little experiment where I guess they, um, they uh, set up a little uh, petri, um, a uh, petri slab or whatever, a, lo a large petri dish over a map of Tokyo, and then put a little bit of food. Um, I guess, I guess what they're saying is that the uh, mold um, grew um, in a similar way to the uh, Tokyo uh, railway system. <laughs> I mean. Without a brain, I mean, that's because they're acting as, like, a collective, you know? Dad decided to check the history of her eight-year-old brother's iPad. Okay. So, what? So, what, um... So, this girl's dad was checking this... Some girl's brother's iPad? But, yeah. Kind of wondering what this dad decided to check on. This eight-year-old's iPad. I mean, seriously, why why give a fucking eight-year-old iPad an iPad in the first place? I mean, I think there are, like, kids' tablets um, out there in the market. Okay. So did you know that the tallest skyscraper in the world, Burj Khalifa, is in the quote-unquote city, Dubai, which is in the United Arab Emirates? Did you know that Dubai isn't a country? I'm pretty sure most of us knew that Dubai isn't a country. Okay, uh, Blender. I've tested hash hashtag mushroom, hashtag Alice Vision, I'm thrilled. Thanks to hashtag Blender 3D, hashtag B3D 2.8, it looks even better. The shoes in the game, hashtag Conscious Mind from hashtag Moonville Entertainment will be great. 
https colon slash st.co slash 7 eok capital j capital x sp capital b capital e yeah <laughs> i wonder where that fucking link leads to eh, probably not gonna look at it but i don't know how hashtags work in reddit but these 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 hashtags just gored up that fucking post title to a pretty large extent if God did the existence, then why wife had baby without the sex? Um, uh, I, they might be uh, questioning on the uh, how Virgin Mary became pregnant with baby Jesus. Um, I hadn't been I haven't been Christian since like 2014, um, but honestly, I mean I have I have my own hypothesis about it, but it's probably gonna offend a shit ton of people, but. That, that's something that's going to remain up for debate, uh, just just because just because of the current Christian narrative and shit. All right, next, a lady died and went to heaven. Upon seeing God, she says, "There is one this I always wanted to know." Okay, they probably fucked that up. I think what they mean is, upon seeing God, she says, basically, I guess I guess they're trying to say that. That she's exclaiming to God that he's the one she wanted to know or something. Ugh. I don't know. Glacier melts on Everest exposes dead bodies due to global warming. I mean, to, to me, this is another obvious one, I guess. Okay, first off, uh, aren't glaciers like blocks of ice that sort of fall into a body of liquid water? You know, and sort of float around. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure Mount Everest and the Himalayas in general are landlocked. I mean, unless they're talking about like river glaciers or something, but it could be possible that um, that the very that the uh, um, that the uh, multitude of dead bodies could be exposed due to ice melting on it. I guess. All right. Okay, last but not least, this little train wreck. We. Just, just we. Uh, uh, is, is there supposed to be a picture involved with this we? This Nintendo we? I hope so. <laughs> okay, alright, I, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and at this fucking video, and, uh, I hope you at least somewhat enjoy this. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, I think I'm, uh, I think that's is yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be doing any more Reddit videos for a while. Alright, thank you, and good night.